So this is a warning. There are a lot of flashing lights um, happening in this video. So please be careful when watching this video. Okay, so hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. And welcome back to the Life is Strange. First off, oh, I don't know why, but the only time my computer, my whole computer uh, freezes is when I play this game. Yeah, I I don't know what's happening because it wasn't like this when I first started it out, but now it's just yeah. So, um, so there will be like a gap between last part and this part, and fingers crossed, knock on wood, whatever works, that it won't crash again. Cause I feel like. I'm so close to finishing episode 4 that I just want to finish everything in one part. Okay, so before I press continue, I guess I'll kind of tell you like the summary of what happened in between. So first off, Max and Chloe go goes to Frank's RV and then like we have like this little talk and depending on the choices that you make. Uh, you either hurt Frank with a gun, I think. Well, Chloe accidentally shoots Frank. Or, um, I think you kill Frank, maybe. I'm not sure about the other options, but, um, yeah. And then the last option, which is, I guess, the good one is... No one gets hurt, everything is just talked through, and no hard feelings. And that is the option that I had because I guess I made the quote-unquote right choices. And then so, yeah, and then after that um, talk, Frank give a, gives us like his, um, whatchamacallit, like this encoded paper because we received a book from him well not received but we kind of stole it from his rv and in it it had like apparently all of his customers but the thing was it was not their real name i guess that's the, like he's really smart but um it was actually like written as a certain dog breed and we needed that paper in order to find out who was who so we found out that Rottweiler was Nathan so we got that and then we went back to Chloe's room and then we had like this big board we had clues from Frank from David and then Nathan because if you guys remember last time we raided Nathan's room and we stole his phone so yeah we did all the knickknacks little things and we I guess tracked down um Nathan's location points maybe i forgot what the exact term was but i think it's like the location point that david had and then that led to this freaky old old barn that i guess used to belong to his grandfather great great grandfather i don't know who but it was a prescott and then uh in that barn we found out like a hidden door on the floor and then through Max's superpower and like wit we were able to open it and then we went in and then there was some strange freaky thing going on so there was like a, I guess like a photography room kind of thing where it was all white and if you guys remember Kate said she thought she was in the hospital because everything was so white and I think Nathan took her to that room and uh, I think that's pretty much it from what I can remember. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, yeah. So, oh, yeah. So, okay. So in that room, um, we also found like a um, cabinet full of binders. And in that binder, um, we found... Victoria's, Kate's, and Rachel Amber's. And Victoria's binder was empty, but Kate and Amber, um, it was filled with photos 
of them in like posi- poses and things like that. And Kate, you know, she was kind of tied up, she was crying, and then someone took a picture of that, assuming it's, you know, I'm assuming it's Nathan. And the thing is, when looking at Rachel Ambers, we found out that she was dead. No joke. She was dead. And then I guess they, in that um, binder, there was a picture of um, Nathan, maybe, but there was a picture of someone digging a hole in the ground. That part, uh, like, that part didn't show, but, like, Chloe and Max was, like, talking, and then, you know, so, um, so, Chloe and Rachel, not Rachel, Chloe and Max go to the junkyard where we, like, did the shooting ranges, they go and then start digging, digging the ground, and then they find Rachel Lambert there. So she has been dead for who knows how long, but the smell was really horrible. So I'm guessing like at least a few weeks or maybe more, maybe less. I'm not sure, but yeah, so it was really sad. It was unexpected. I did not. I didn't think she would be dead, you know. But it's a very heavy part. And when looking through the binder, Max and Chloe, they ass- they're they assuming that Victoria will be next. Will be the next victim because her binder was empty. But that's pretty much the whole gist of it. Hopefully you guys understood a little bit of what I have just said. But yeah, we're at the Vortex Club. Okay, so as okay, you can Chloe, assume, Chloe you? is Clo- Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. Chloe it is super kind of pissed well, off. Some of the Vortex Club always give me attitude. Stella, that's what they're here for. Speak. <gasps> uh, hi, Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Nathan's creepy? What girl? We... What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here Who for the Who hired job. you? Anything unusual. Anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I noticed they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have canceled the party. Guess I'm not cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. Thank you. I'll okay, so you this is Stella, him. and she was one of the names <laughs> that was written in Frank's book. So I'm not sure if it's this Stella or, you know. Oh, they're doing it in the swimming pool. Aren't they high schoolers? Like, are they okay? Is the teacher okay with, like, them drinking? Because you don't see this, but um, it was before they entered this uh, actual party. Um, We met a drunk Warren. Who the hell is she? We have to find Victoria.
Let's see if we can talk we to anyone. To find Nathan and take him down. Nope. Alyssa. Oh. I'm not gonna change that. I don't want Alyssa to be like, you know. Her name's not even on it though. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but okay. this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to Victoria talk to you. Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney so is who the hell to be the are you, you no neighbor? So please go. Yup. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? If I get sick now, Does apparently to Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. To uh, what was in that shit? Yo, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. Want to get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. You don't even. You don't have and to scream. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? I'm never Besides, Dana is here. Oh, Justin. So yes, this party sucks. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore text club. Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get Who's my board and grind. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we have guys using the restroom. Gross. How did this even get here? We've been vomiting for like an hour. Maybe you're not the only one who has to get Somebody's sick. either having sex or throwing up. up or both. In, okay. Good night, sweet prince. Why are the... Oh, are they using the guy's restroom? Oh my gosh. So there's nothing to do here. When I la launched, yeah, okay. So I did. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh my gosh. But um. Oh my gosh. Okay, what was I about to say? Yeah, I forgot. Blackwell is having a party after Kate almost jumped off a roof. 
I guess people are happy that Cage is okay now and they can party again. I'm just happy she's drawing again. Her voice sounds she different. She seems much better and her mother's being so supportive for a change. Kate deserves that. I saw that the video got taken down, so I, I hope nobody posts it anywhere else. Is that naive? Look how fast people here forgot about Kate. They'll find some new Blackwell drama and forget about um, her video. Vortex. So it goes. Maybe I should ask Justin about the other two options I had. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have a good time. Victoria. Even if I hate most of them. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. <laughs> or Kate. She must know I'd punch her in the face. I probably should just for Vortex Club posterity. Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section. Like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why? Well, so I remember I what I was about to do. I mean, Good about luck. to say. So because my game or my computer freezes a lot, I did do like the safe launcher thing. So I don't, I guess it's the same for all, um, Life is Strange game, hopefully, but there are two options when you press play. It's either play Life is Strange or play like the safe launch thing. And I did the safe launch thing hoping that it won't crash and I could get through the whole game. Or at least this part of the episode. <coughs> hey, Courtney. How are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? <laughs> it really must be the end of the world. <laughs> Get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yes, it is very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, oh, which little. you're not and will <laughs> never be. So oh, that crazy. little... Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. Energy you drinks. Probably soda, do. Energy drinks. Brooke. I know somebody has the booze. Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. Waiting so for what? why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Oh my Being? god, Brooke. Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Brooke, enough. I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the movies. But you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm selfish while you go on a roof to help save your friend. You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave uh, you uh, superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young, Brooke. Why can't so I have we, a... Max. So let's play a drone game next glow stick. And where's Chloe? Oh, can we like take... Oh, I can't take one. Okay, so how the hell am I supposed to do this? Yeah, so maybe it's because of the safe launcher thing that like you could kind of hear like the buffering and you could even actually see it too, but push. Okay, 
Oh, Max! Look at her face! Oh Crap. Was I supposed to go the other way? Shift. Why am I over here? Oh my god, don't tell me I have to go all the way around. Why can't I run? Okay. Oh, I guess we'll enter. Is this the VIP section? Do we just go in like that? How? Okay, I was so happy to see your smile again. You mean so much to me and to so many others. I have to go, but I also wanted to say have fun at the movies with Warren. He's so sm oh, he's so sweet. He brought buy some school books I need it. Give him a hug for me. I will call me soon as you can. Okay. Then we, of course, took a picture of the owl. We have to find Nathan. Nathan is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. Okay, so how the hell did I just go in like this? Was there just something happen Trevor. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. <laughs> He's so different than Logan. We actually talked about life. And he knows how to be safe. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. Vortex Club? The Vortex Club is also enabling him. I know. Juliet wrote a story describing it like a cult, and I'm starting to think she was right. It's not fun anymore. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. That sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. <laughs> The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Of her? course I'm warning her, no matter- we'll Although I hate her. Victoria, your picture so has to win. Who's yeah, this? that would be wicked. Uh, did you hear- I'm trying. Sorry, Max. Vortex clumpers only. Sorry. I'm on the Are guest we? list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, in Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. You're not blaming you. Oh. Nathan, don't blame. I'm not, I'm not gonna blame her. Like, I don't want... To make the situation any worse i want her to like me you know just so that we could warn her about nathan i don't blame you victoria but you know kate had a church group and that she didn't party so why did you send out that video oh god i swear we weren't even going to do it then we had some wine and got stupid it's more than stupid it's mean hateful Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop me from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Maybe I'm not her friend, but I didn't get off on Kate attempting suicide. I'm not evil, Max. 
I believe you, Victoria, but I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what? I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> oh my god. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own oh, a gallery. Geez. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but... Wait, what about Nathan? Make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Not enemies. No need. Why not? Does, does, does it even make sense? She asked us, do you think it's fate that we're not enemies? That we're not supposed to be friends? I just say. Good. <gasps> I have uh, real friends. I wouldn't want a fake one. Oh, oh my god. Right. You're the faker. Acting That's like not what I was about to say. Covered in that paint. Who do you think set up the paint can to fall? Oh no, oh no. You did that? You bitch. You could have killed me with that oh, fucking shoot. can. I almost got that freak Samuel fired. And that would have been bad. You're right, Victoria. No, I want to go back. You actually think you're better than me. No fucking way. Guess I'll never be a oh! member of the Vortex Club. No, bitch, you won't. Oh no! I have to go back. <laughs> Damn it! Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now, so listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so we could take her someplace. Dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? Touche. But I am not fucking around here. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. I don't believe anything you say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a oh. photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just want to take your little retro selfies. Oh my god, so please let me... And lazy, Max. Just go find What's wrong with follow. CCs? Victoria, <laughs> please don't do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see I'm serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Oh, no! No! <gasps> oh shoot, I can't <gasps> I can't rewind. Oh my god. Oh I can't. Okay, oh. I tried. Wait, shift. She's not gonna believe me over her vortex club partner. Oh god, okay, that scared me. I thought we couldn't rewind. Oh my god. That is that was not what I was trying to do. <laughs> I really want to warn her. I really want her to be on our good side. Okay, so starting over, where's the- What kind of dance is that? That son of a bitch is not here. Where are you, Nathan? I better get Chloe. Yo, leave. I don't want to leave. How the hell do I- Wait, this is Taylor. Oh, oh, why are we on the opposite side? Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna speak to Victoria. And hopefully... Mac, do you even have Kate Marsh? That's not... Oh my god, okay. Ow, I accidentally hit my hand on my mirror. So we're not gonna blame her, or should we just go directly to Nathan? Oh crap. No, I I think I'll do this situation first. I don't blame so you, Victoria. Skip. Oh god. It's more I deleted it. I that makes Okay. So you have talent. We have to be nice to her. You have talent. No, it's on point, Matt. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fake? Okay, so this part. Friends? Am I supposed to say not enemies or why not? Okay, let's try not enemies. Maybe, but. Okay, this sounds a lot better. Be enemies. Whoever makes that decision, that would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. Oh wait, this... but not for the reasons you think. Oh, oh you crap! Look so serious. Oh my God, the last part didn't sound so good. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your. Okay, so I'm guessing she's gonna be okay with us saying that. He's dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Okay, so. Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. Wait, are you serious? You're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks. And I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um. Oh. Text Aww, me if you need it. So anything. sweet. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Okay, so we warned her and she um listened to us. So that's always good. Because that was my goal in the first place. So Victoria can be a nice person as well. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Oxygen kit? No. I'm glad I warned her. I hope she's okay. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Oh, Jefferson. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Um, are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just... Looking for Nathan. Uh huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, so... This is where Jefferson announces... Okay, okay everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, 
I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about it. <laughs> now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy. And Except for Nathan. Our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, also you're all corny, in so cheesy. The envelope, please. Victoria. And the winner is. Oh my, what a shocker! Victoria <laughs> Chase. Oh my God, it's so fake. <laughs> Incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell. I don't know if and she's real or she's that. just saying that. Thank you. Victoria won. I can't believe she blacked out Jefferson. Yes, I can. He fucking cares. Rachel is still dead, and I want to this punk ass now. Me too. We didn't. Let's go check out the dormitories. She already checked it out. Nathan just texted me. He says there will be. Glad you got one last look at Rachel. Though. Nobody will know. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard uh -huh. right now. Damn. Oh yes, and then there were two moons. I forgot to mention that. I'm pretty sure that's part a really important part. around Chloe right just get ready to use your rewind fast and Nathan tries to jump us. oh I hate how she's so relaxed she's so you know she's re relying so much <laughs> that's the word relying so much on Max's powers wait I can move I guess I have to follow Chloe I think we should just go back to the place where Rachel Amber was buried. Oh my god! God, I'm gonna fucking kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't focus if you're yelling. Oh, this is Please. so scary. Oh no, Chloe! I'm not doing that. Over and over. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe! Max, you have please to hurry. be quiet. I hope this is the right place. I... Oh God, Max! Look, she's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Don't look what? Why? Why are you backing up? Oh my god! Chloe! <gasps> what the fuck? Oh my god! What? What just happened? Chloe. Oh, wait, is she. <gasps> Oh my gosh. <gasps> Jefferson <laughs> Oh my gosh. 
What was that? <laughs> what was that? We're going to skip. Holy crap. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, so that was a very unexpected um twist. Oh. Okay, but before this game crashes, I'll just continue on with this. I'm going to Yeah, hopefully I'll just kind of calm down a little bit. So, 42% refused to close because 58% actually accepted. Oh my gosh. But I don't think this really matters because we go back to the present anyways. So, yeah. And then 59% stopped Warren from beating up Nathan. 72% um, no one got hurt. Yeah, so it's either kill, wounded, or no one got hurt. So, 74% uh, believed, uh, Victoria believed your warning. And they didn't even warn Victoria. I feel like although she's like not such a good person, she still deserves to know. Next. Uh, you saved the bluebird. Wait, is this... I didn't even see the bluebird's nest, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Mm. Oh, there was another way to find it. Okay. How do you get the Kate didn't help you option? I don't even remember this part. Oh. Oh, I should have done that. It says cute right here. Oh, man. Wait, if you don't figure out Nathan's pin code, then what happens? 21% didn't help Alyssa. Oh, no. So, I guess this is the preview for episode 5. Oh, no. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so Nathan and Jefferson are connected somehow I guess and it was not Nathan it was Mr. Jefferson who was the big jerk so yeah Ooh, I can't wait for the last episode but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this part and I hope to see you guys next time bye